Hi, this is Chris with Core Fitness, and today we're going to go over some exercises for Pilates that you can do on a foam roller. So if you have a one of the longer full-size foam rollers, we're going to use that. We're going to use uh, dumbbells and a ball. So first thing you want to do is you're positioning yourself on the roller, and you want to have that length to support your neck here. So Think of the tailbone coming down to the very end of the roller. Let your body relax on the roller. Let your arms open up. Take a few breaths and just let your body sink in. So think of your vertebrae one at a time imprinting on the roller. And just get your body ready for the uh, movements that we're going to do. So the roller obviously here is going to add a lot of instability. So place your hands just on the floor, just a little bit wider than your mat. We're going to start with marching. You're going to take one leg up and then the other. So you're going to find that there's instability just by lifting that leg. So your core has to work. You're exhaling and inhaling. And then you can add on to this movement. You're going to take your leg to 90. And your opposite arm up towards the ceiling. This is a dead butt. You're stretching out that arm and leg and coming back in. Inhale to reach out. Exhale to bring it in. And again, this takes a little bit more core stabilization. And then you'll switch sides. Leg to 90, arm up. Reaching out and bringing it in. Feel that nice lengthening stretch through your body. And then from here, we're going to go ahead and find our weights. So the weights are included here. To add a little bit more challenge, we're going to do some pressing. So you're going to push up and you're going to bring it down. You're going to exhale, inhale. So lifting your heel, alternating heel lifts and press. Just that little movement adds some instability. Heel up, press. Heel up, press. Good. And then coming into your bird dog extension with that leg out long and reaching. We're not trying to touch our leg. We're just coming up and back down. Same thing on the other side. You're extending, leg and arm come up, back. Try not to arch that low back. Taking those arms down, we're going to find that small ball. We're going to place it between our inner thighs. And again, keeping your position on the roller, tapping down and lifting up. Inhaling and exhaling. Really feeling the lower abs kicking in. Inhaling and exhaling. Taking that ball out. Coming into a small lift, hand support the head. You're curling up, lifting, and lowering. Curling up, lift. Another set of exercises that you can do using the foam roller our elevated legs. So you're gonna take your legs into position, heels together into your frog, so bending, pressing. So you've got the roller underneath your sacrum. You're pushing out. You can add the arms here, press. As you bring those legs up and pull down. You can add scissors. One leg at a time, inhaling and exhaling. You can add some circles, down, around, and up. Reversing, down, around, and up. Reversing, you can bring your arms into some circles as well. And reverse direction. Bicycles, reaching those arms up, 